So guys, Apple has released iOS 16 beta 3 to registered developers and here is what's new in it. Also today in this video, I'm going to show you how you can install it. So without further ado, let's get started. You know, Apple revealed iOS 16, iPadOS 16 and macOS Ventura during the keynote and iPhone has got a lot of love, particularly when it comes to the lock screen. We also got improvements to mail, messages, FaceTime, reminders and many more. So without further ado, let's see what's new in iOS 16 beta 3. And just word of a warning, this one is a beta version so it might contain bugs and fixes and improvements and such kind this beta version should be deployed into the device dedicated for the development purpose well talking about the first one we got lockdown mode well this mode is an extreme security measure that you should only use if you believe you are being targeted by someone you know when you enable this mode right from your settings attachments in your messages are disabled and these including links and also certain web technologies are blocked also facetime calls and invitations from strangers sent through apple services are blocked as well next one you got icloud shared photo library well ios 16 beta 3 introduces this new icloud shared photo library uh, this feature allows you to automatically share relevant photos and videos with family or friends the person who creates shared library has to provide needed icloud storage for it then next one we got new wallpapers well ios 16 beta 3 adds new clownfish wallpaper which is this one right over here it's the same one steve jobs previewed when introducing the very first iphone in 2007 wallpaper never actually made to any iphone model until now but now it's available and next one you got new lock screen fonts well ios 16 beta 3 adds two new fonts to users to choose from prior to this build users were limited to just six instead of eight so now you can see two new added fonts right over here next one you got continuity camera tweaks well ios 16 beta 2 adds this pause button right over here to continuity camera ui this feature allows you to temporarily pause the video feed streaming to your mac from your phone next one you got new lock screen filters well ios 16 beta 2 introduces two new lock screen filters color wash and duotone you can try them swiping horizontally in customization mode next one we got iMessage tweaks when ios 16 beta 2 user edits iMessage sent to someone on ios 15 or earlier it will send a duplicate text that reflects the text edit mode on ios 16 beta 1 well this behavior was not present on other older versions of os so unfortunately there is no way to tell that whether this message has been tweaked or not next one we got mail tweaks well ios 16 beta 2 users can choose if an email from a blog sender remains in the inbox or gets automatically trashed by default you so now you can leave it into the inbox or move to the trash and block sender messages will automatically move to the trash if you select this option then next one we got focus tweaks well apart from that ios 16 beta 2 this also allows users to select which focus mode share user status with their apps and this allows you to share with others that you have enabled focus when using the work mode but not gaming mode for example and also they got backup to iCloud over cellular or Wi-Fi as per the Apple release notes iOS 16 beta 2 allows users to backup their phones using 4G 5G or Wi-Fi this is specifically useful for those people who rely on mobile data and typically don't have access to Wi-Fi network if you want to download this version of iOS 16 beta well I have given link in the description for the video that we have did earlier you can follow this method and download and, and try it out iOS 16 beta guys i hope this video was helpful so make sure to hit that like share this video subscribe to our channel and this is kedar from how to guys signing out